Hello year two and any other children listening, it's Mrs Ray here. Just wanted to say that I miss you all and I'm really looking forward to having you all back to school safe and sound. But until then, I wanted to read you one of my favourite stories called I Want a Monkey by Daniel Errico. Wally was sure that he wanted a pet. He talked to his dad about which pet to get. I want a monkey who scratches his head. He'd swing in the house and he'd jump on the bed. Well, said his dad in a kind sort of way. Did you know that monkeys eat bugs every day? Oh, no, Wally said. We have none to eat. Mum likes to squash all the bugs with her feet. Then I want a hippo, he screamed to his dad. He'd eat all our trash and Mum would be glad. Hippos need water. It helps them stay cool. I guess we can build him a giant-sized pool. No, Wally said. He'd be too big to dry. We'd need a mountain of towels to try. I want an otter who triple backflips. I practice swimming when we go for dips. Did you know most otters can whistle and chirp? They growl and snort and perhaps even burp. Oh, Wally said with a sad looking frown. We'd have to tell him to keep the noise down. Let's get a giraffe, Wally said with a smile. I'd slide from his neck to a giant clothes pile. Giraffes hold the record for tallest of all. The jump from their head is a 20 foot fall. Gosh, Wally said as he looked at the ceiling. He'd bump his head even if he were kneeling. Well, how about a bunny, he said to his dad. A fluffy and floppy one can't be that bad. Bunnies like eating and chew all your stuff. Raising a bunny can be really tough. Wow, Wally answered. Is that really true? Picking a pet is not easy to do. I want a fish, Wally said. Let's get one. I think a goldfish can be lots of fun. Hmm, said his dad with a look of delight. Good idea, Wally. I think that you're right. They're really good swimmers and make funny faces. And if we get two, we could watch them have races. OK, said his dad. That's just what we'll do. One goldfish for me and one goldfish for you.